A Weird UFO Abduction Experience In like 2007 I was at home and my roommate at the time was like yo let's go to the casino. I had nothing else to do, so we got into his SUV and drove the hour to the casino. We were there from about 7 p.m. until about 1.30 a.m. On the way home we had to drive through town to get onto the highway to get home. I begged him to stop at a gas station so I could get something to eat since I had not eaten since 8 p.m. the day before. So I was starving. I popped into the station and grabbed a bag of chip and a chocolate bar. I hopped back into his SUV and started to eat the chocolate bar. I finished that up just before we got towards the highway entrance and I opened my bag of chips. I reached in and ate a chip. Then went and grabbed another. Next thing I know we are back in our city on the main road waiting at a stoplight with other cars. I looked at him, still holding the second chip in my hand and he said, Do you remember that? Dot. And I asked him what he meant. He said, Do you remember driving here? Like taking the highway and getting off and driving here? I told him no and that for some reason for the last 40 minutes. Or so I had been holding the same chip in my hand. And had not ate anything. I had no memory of the last 40 minutes at all. We kinda sat there in silence as traffic moved forward and we got into the left hand turn lane to turn. There was construction in that intersection so we were right next to one of those large concrete construction divider things. And they continued up ahead of us through the intersection. We just missed our light to turn left so we were first in line for the green for the next light. As we sat there talking about it, this bright light, like the size of a baseball, came shooting towards the SUV. Right down that center line where the dividers were. And went over the top of the car and shot off somewhere we couldn't see. If I had to guess the speed, like 200 kmph or more. It was like a rocket just zipping by, but it was definitely in front of us and then went up when it got to the front of the SUV. Both of us kinda braced for impact when it was coming towards us. I thought it was a motorcycle with one headlight, but it happened so fast that I didn't know. That was just what I thought it was at the time. However when talking to my roommate about it we came to the conclusion that it was not a vehicle at all and that it was flying and not driving. Plus the fact that it was four feet off the ground and going down the middle of the road where there were those concrete dividers. Like it was flying right on top of those. I've not talked to him since like 2009 or so. But when we did talk about this incident we both can't figure out what happened with the missing time. We can't remember driving at all. He eventually chalked it up to road hypnosis where you can drive for hours. And not really remember much because it is all the same. However for me that doesn't make any sense, because why would I stop eating the whole time when I was starving? What was that white ball of light that shot over the SUV? How can both of us have the same hypnosis at the same time? for the same duration and notice that we were in it at the exact same time when we came to. Dot. So yeah, that's my story on that. No other weird things happened to him or me, that I know of since then, regarding loss of time. White lights or anything like that at all. Post from user Mr. Cricks at, at Reddit.